what's going on everybody i'm going to be talking about american horror story cult and this is the seventh season in the show so right away we get uh, the feel of the show it's going to be a mixture of real fears and clown fears and the real fears is the fear of donald trump winning and being the president and that kind of spooked a lot of people because a lot of the media misled people thinking that he was going to lose and thinking here we had it by a landslide. And then the M. Peters character is absolutely some crazy Donald Trump fan. And in the first scene, he goes nuts when Trump wins. And he's like ecstatic. He's like, yes, yes, the rebellion wins. And he goes and he's eating a bag of Cheetos and he throws it in the blender and he covers his face with the Cheetos. And like that's like a big joke because, you know, he's our Cheeto skin president. So then they cut to the other scene, which is the Sour Paulson character. And she's going to be a pivotal character in the series because not only is she afraid of clowns, which is a big theme in this, in this series, but we also she's very liberal and she's she has a she has a wife she's a lesbian and when trump wins she it's just in tears the the world's gonna end they're gonna break all you know same-sex marriages apart they're gonna deport all the immigrants she's just crying she's going crazy and i like this because it's actually something that went on when trump won and it's like yeah, I remember when it happened. It happened last year. That's why it's pretty cool. It's very recent fear. And we also got Billy Lord, who is Carrie Fisher's daughter. She plays a big part in this episode. She plays the babysitter of Sarah Holson's kid. She's got, like, silver hair. She's I think she's going to be one of the clown characters. Uh, and Evan Peters has blue, blue hair. So he's obviously going to be one of the clowns. And we get into, like, this really cool segment where we're on a field and there's, like, this young couple and they're making out and they're talking about the the myth of Twisty the Clown. And he shows up. and But it turns out to be, like, this kind of creep show segment because it pulls away and it's a kid, like, reading a comic book. I thought that's really cool. I love the creep show movies. You know, George Romero, creep show, Stephen King. Uh, big mix there because this season with the clowns and it going on feels a little Stephen Kenny there and I really like the clowns that really show up that terrorize Sarah Paulson she is terrified by clowns now she's crying and nobody believes her nobody believes that she's seen clowns but there's clowns around and they're murdering people like next door neighbor and she she's like trying to tell people that there's clowns around and nobody believes her I'm really digging, I'm like, this is going to be a bold statement. I think this is going to be as good as, as Murder House. I think it's going to be as good as Murder House because I think, because I think the last few seasons kind of been dwindling and kind of limbo. I did like Freak Show. I did like Coven and Hotel. Eh, I thought it was a good concept, but I think it teetered up. And Roanoke. Was a good concept. It kind of teetered out. Also, this is going to be as good as Murder House. So if you if you've been skipping out on American Horror Story, get back in, get back in on this show because it's going to be full of clowns, murder, mayhem, craziness. Evan Peter looks like he's at the top of his game, and his Sarah Paulson is always great. I love during the, the O.J. Simpson trial. She's good. I don't know why she's not in movies. Great. Great series, great opening to a new season of American Horror Story. So let me know what you thought. Let me know what you, your favorite part was and what you think the season is going to be. If, it can, if it's going to get good or it's going to kind of teeter down. This is kind of like the highest hot. High, and then it's going to go like some of the other seasons. Like and subscribe and I will see you later.